welcome to today's video. I just wanted to show you a haul of some pet things I've got. Um, I'm getting a pug, pug puppy, so um, I've been doing some shopping to collect some stuff and I wanted to show you. You might like it. Um, so yeah, just to show you what I've got. Um, food bowls and water bowls. I really like this with all the spots on. I thought it was quite cool. Um, and I prefer these as water bowls. They're heavier. They can't knock them over. So yeah, that's a water bowl. The food bowls, I've got one, I've got two actually, one with sort of a rubbery bit round to stop it sliding on the floor, um, it's not too deep, it's quite shallow, which is great for pugs, um, and also one like this, so it doesn't have the rubber grip, but still shallow, and stainless steel's best for food bowls, in my opinion, easy to clean, whack them in the dishwasher, great. Um, this, I really like this. This came from Pets at Home. Um, it's crinkle and squeak, so he squeaks in his head and he crinkles in his body, but he's all flat, like he's been run over. But I really liked it. Um, hopefully the pug will too, because that's who it's for. But yeah, that's quite cool. I'll put links for all these things um, in the description if you do want to have a look at any of this afterwards. Now this, I really like this. Um, lovely big blanket. And it's really nice and soft. This also came from Pets at Home. It's an RSPCA blanket. I think it was about £12, but it's it's great. It's perfect size. You can put it on your lap, put it on the sofa, wrap your little pug or dog puppy up in it. It's really, really great. Um, the other one I did buy, which I don't think is so great, it came from Amazon. And it's this one. It's nice and fluffy, the same, but it's not as big which, you know, it's okay for in the car on your lap, I suppose, but I didn't like it as much as this one. This one I could have for myself, actually. But, um, yeah. What else? Some more toys. Now, um, this came from Pets at Home. I thought it was really funny. And it wasn't that expensive, actually. I think it was a pound. And it's got a squeak in it. That's Pets at Home, if I haven't already said. But that's really cool. Um... And this one, this came from Pampered Pets, I think. I've been collecting things for a while, so I forgot where some of it's come from. But again, there's a squeak in there, a little ball. It's a nice toy. Um, these. These are great. Um, for a teething puppy, this is the puppy starter pack. These came from, um, did I get these? Amazon were the best price. I think they were £4.50. Um, whereas if you go into the pet shops, they're £10. So I did get these from Amazon. But um, for a teething puppy or something to chew on to keep them off your furniture, these are great. Also, I have taken this out of the packet, or my children took it out of the packet, is just a puppy brush. This came from Pets at Home. Um, it was £3 and it's just a simple puppy brush, really. I also got a harness. Oh my god, there's a massive spider just ran across the bedroom. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, we'll sort that out later. Right, this puppy harness. This was an extra small, or extra extra small. I think it was in the puppy section of Pets at Home. It was six pounds and it's really great. It adjusts really really easy and it does get quite big. So I think I think it said it was for miniature Yorkshire Terriers or miniature um, Chihuahuas, so they must be tiny, but this will be great for a puppy, as pugs are better in a harness than with a collar. If you like pugs, you'll know that. Um, so yeah, with a lead. We've also got a red lead. This is just Ankle. I think this came from Pampered Pets as well. This was a while ago. I'm not really a fan of Pampered Pets. I like pets at home. Um, or Amazon's quite cheap, but I like to see what I'm buying before I buy it. Uh, which is why I like pets at home, but unfortunately the closest one to us is about 40 minutes away. So, it's not great, but... And the last thing I got, which came from Cadbury's Garden Centre, um, is this lovely bed. Um, it was 23 and I don't know what the make is. Jollies. 
pet food jollies. Pet food jollies. Um, yeah, so Cabby Garden Centre. This is where this came from. It's lovely and soft. The inside bit comes out. You can wash it, I suppose. Put it back in. But yeah, I wish I was a pug puppy <laughs> with all these nice things. So yeah, I'll leave links for things down below um, so you can check any of it out if you liked any of it. Um, but yeah, I'll keep you updated on when my puppy arrives. Thanks for watching.